Saleh, hello. How are you? Hi, how are you? Very I'm fine. Good. I'm good. Hello. So yes, my name is Matt. Yeah. Um, I'm the graphic artist of Hell Studio. Nice to meet you, Matt. All nice the way from London. You. Could you tell us a little bit about you? Yeah, for sure, for sure. I'm Kenyan, born and bred right here in Nairobi. Uh, I'm a graffiti artist uh, and also a visual artist. Uh, I'm excited to be part of this project. Looking forward to it. Do you have a place uh, in mind where we can do this project? Yeah, actually I have a place. It's a community-based school. They host a, a secondary school, a primary school, an early childhood development class. Single mothers and uh, young girls in the community are also taught different skills. So it's a community-based environment. I think it will be a good place to place this mural. Actually, we'll have a mini workshop before we start the actual painting of the wall. In the workshop, each kid will be required to like uh, sketch down whatever this information they have heard about the COVID. Now, to me, kujia to kafunza COVID-19 misinformation. Na pia to me difunza ku ku draw, ku chora, na ku paint. Na pia ita to saidia to kwa to kwa kubwa ku paint na pia ku saidia talent. Just uh, get our concepts out there. And moving forward, we go towards, towards working on the wall. And the wall is quite big, it's around a 70 meter stretch. So we are sure everybody in the community will actually interact with the artwork. will be able to pick out the, the most prevalent misinformation and, uh, and find a way of uh, putting out the correct information about the kind of misinformation they have had. So we'll have a kind of a balance in the work. We are going to have the kids involved where they're going to help even in the application of the paint on the wall and just generally executing of the mural. Yes, kuna maari kama niko na kabiza hapo, nimeitiwa. Sasa ndena na mwari wangu, tuchore. Je suis allé à la fin de la journée et je suis allé à la fin de la journée.